Happy Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from a far western Kentucky field located near the Mississippi River, where a 410 engine horsepower John Deere 8RX 410 4-tracked fixed frame tractor is working on no-till planting corn with a 60-foot wide, 36-row, 20-inch spaced John Deere DB60 planter. In this video, we're going to take a look at the tractor's production history, specifications, and price tag, as well as climbing up in the cab to visit with the operator about planting corn with this big machinery. But first, let's head out to the field so you can see and hear this corn planting team in action. We can see that this 36 row DB60 is no tilling into the field and that means there's no primary tillage, secondary tillage. The seeds are going directly into the soil with minimal disturbance to the surface. The seeds right in here and it will sprout and it reduces the amount of equipment and tillage needed, labor, and the crop goes in very easily. John Deere introduced the 8RX series of fixed frame four track tractors in late October 2019. These machines went into full production in June of 2020, and the series includes the model 8RX 310, 8RX 340, 8RX 370, and the 8RX 410. These large track tractors, ranging from 310 to 410 engine horsepower, are manufactured by John Deere at its Waterloo, Iowa tractor factory, which has been building tractors since 1918. The 8RX 410 is the largest tractor in the 8RX series. Its model number breaks down the tractor's designation and features in the full John Deere tractor lineup, which ranges from the 1 series that starts at 23 engine horsepower and goes all the way up to 640 engine horsepower in the 9 series. The R designation stands for premium tractor. X indicates that this machine has four tracks and 410 indicates the tractor's engine horsepower rating. The 8RX 410 is powered by a 9 liter John Deere turbocharged 6 cylinder 549 cubic inch engine rated at 410 engine horsepower. The tractor can achieve 443 maximum horsepower when it encounters tough field conditions that it needs to power through. And the tractor offers 310 PTO horsepower for powered implements. 
This tractor is equipped with the John Deere E23 electronic variable transmission, which has 23 forward and 11 reverse speeds with the capability of running up to 24 miles per hour. 8RX can have their tracks spaced out at 76, 80, 88, or 120 inches. They can be fitted with 18 inch, 24 inch, or 30 inch belts. The 8RX 410 has a 244 gallon diesel fuel tank and a 37.2 gallon diesel exhaust fluid tank for clean engine solutions. When the tractor rolls off the assembly line in Waterloo, Iowa, the 8RX 410 weighs in at 43,000 pounds and can be field weighted up to 53,000 pounds. According to JohnDeere.com, for model year 2022, the 8RX 410 track tractor has a list price of $642,340. Now that we've gone over the specifications of the 8RX 410, let's climb up in the cab of the tractor to see the operator's perspective of planting corn with this four-track machine at 60 feet per pass. I'm up in the cab of the 8RX 410 and the tractor is doing the boundaries of the field. We can see the marker arm is out. And now this tractor has adaptive curves, so you just kind of doing the first pass manually and then it'll switch over to GPS. That is correct. That is correct. You can see here as we come up to the corner, the 8RX is very nimble and has tight steering with these tracks and you can get right up to the corner of the field and turn the planter around pretty quickly. Here we can see the operator's good view with the mirrors of the, the tractor and the implement and tow. We can see the marker arm is putting that mark on the boundary out there. So you like using that the marker arm just on the first pass because it just makes you feel a little better about the adaptive curve and the GPS it does. to make the second round? It does. In case it shifts or does anything, you know, I, I can still tell. So. Just for that peace of mind, uh, I like to have it. That's definitely a lot to keep an eye on when you got 60 feet behind you. <laughs> yes, sir, it is. Yes, it is. So here we can see that where the marker arm left that trail and in the good old days, the tractor and the farmer would just follow that back and forth to make sure that each row matched. But now we can see this tractor has the adaptive curve. So the auto steer is on, the tractor is driving itself. And we can see the adaptive curve makes a digital line there on the screen. And the tractor will just follow it across the field. So that, that's some really cool technology. Must make the days a little less tedious to have to worry about it does. where you're at. Absolutely does. Uh, 
I use it all the time. I don't know what I can do without it sometimes, but uh, it's it's nice. It's really nice. So how do you, this tractor is the 410 and it has the E23 transmission. Mm -hmm. how, how do you like that? It's nice, shift smooth, um, plenty of power. I, 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 it's, it's really nice, really nice. Um, it's used, I drove the shuttle shift quite a bit before, or the, uh, I guess, automatic. Mm -hmm. And um, to me, it's about as smooth as that. I mean, it really is nice. There's not many uh, complaints you can find with this tractor, that's for sure. It is very smooth riding. Yes. Now, this farm, you ran eight RTs before, and uh, how would you compare the, the four tracks to the two tracks? Or A um, lot smoother ride, for sure. Um, you know, to me, it, it leaves a smaller, even a smaller footprint than, you know, a regular track. So, I mean, all around, this is, the tractor in my opinion um, it's nice where you can see here we're traveling at just over six miles per hour very smooth ride here in the cab and this is the signature edition so i guess you also have the the heated and massage chair here in the cab that is correct must yeah. make the long hours when you're planting nice oh that i use it quite often yeah i used it last night and i'm sure i'll use it again tonight and then right behind the seat here is an, a refrigerator which is Good for keeping drinks cool and lunch and dinner. Yeah, absolutely. I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field with and up in the cab of the John Deere 8RX 410 fixed frame track tractor planting corn with the DB60 planter. I'd like to hear in the comment section below this video, what is the planting team on your farm? Are you planting corn or small grains? Tell me about the tractor and planter that you're running this spring. If you have enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there's over 2,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you would like to see additional corn planting videos from Big Tractor Power YouTube, continue to watch this video for a few more seconds to the end screen for a direct link to those videos. As always, thank you for watching.